Ever since he first got to the big leagues, Chris Archer has never, ever been known for working quickly. And that's hit to the gap in right center. Benintendi drives it off the wall. And he'll be at second base with one out, beginning a brand new hitting streak. And now he's been on base in 19 consecutive games, and that's a brand new career high. Nice stroke. Knew it was coming. Slider right on it. Good head position. Sixth double on the season. He's a, he's a hit machine. And now comes an impressive young talent. What a game he had last night in shortstop Bobby Witt Jr. And with the runner in scoring position, why not to play a little bit? Let him call you out. And oh. the fastball is ripped oh. into left center field. Oh. The whole field froze and <laughs> ducked when that ball was hit. They weren't sure if that was a line drive or a cannon blast. Oh. And Benintendi scores to make it one nothing KC. Benintendi, it, it almost undressed him. As that ball whistled by him, I wasn't sure if he's going to be able to get another start. But man, it's there's middle. He's looking 90. He's looking for the middle. Their fastball. He got it. And look at Benintendi, man. He had to really get going again to pick it up. Nice first inning run, Ribby. High to center field, and Witt has just enough room. And the wind is blowing in. So that helped Brady Singer and the Royals. And Brady works around the leadoff double. Larnick is getting some playing time with injuries. And today he's the DH. Miguel Sano is out with knee surgery. High fly to center field. Back is Merrifield. Back to the wall. Go on a home run. Larnick ties it. With a blast to the bullpen. Want to get him a fastball. Moving back over the heart of the plate. A two seamer from Singer. Off the end of the bat, and that'll drop in front of Buxton. And Benintendi is two for two, and that gets. Bobby Wood Jr. to the plate. Yeah, ele elevation. Elevated. Wasn't in the middle, but still, he, he shortened up his swing. He recognized it. I don't want to say he tried to do that, but he might have tried to do that right there. Bobby Wood Jr. whistled a line drive into center field and ended up with a double and an RBI. And he's driven in five in the series. And that's drilled to left field. That'll sail over Gordon. And it sticks in the bottom of the wall. And Vance Wilson is going to wave home Benintendi. The throw is not in time. And Junior goes to third. Watch this, ever that, that inside heater at 94, that was his hardest pitch he's thrown all day. And Witt Junior again just pounded it. I mean, laced it. Hasn't hit a softball in a while. And here, Benintendi, look at this. He just kept coming hard. And then. Trevor Vance had to send him because he was coming. Now Dozier hits one off of Archer's glove. That might be an out if it gets over him because Polanco was there, but Archer couldn't resist. When Dozier saw that ball hit his glove, he said, thank you. That's a hit. Yeah, I mean, they, Polanco was sitting right there, would have had it with no problem, but, you know, it's just hard. And that gets away from Sanchez. Dozier will move up to second base. He really admired the ability that he had to hit, win those titles. Get in there. Off the knuckles, and that will be into right field. So the wild pitch is expensive for Archer. And Emmanuel Rivera with two strikes fights it off. The Royals have another two out run. You know, and Rivera had a couple of swings in this at bat that were his swings for a little more power, but that's it on his hands like that. He does that very well. Kept his hands inside, and that's what you call a bleeder. That's just a off the hands like that, and hitting hitters will say, I kind of bled it out to right field, but that that Dozier was was alive on that. That's a perfect two out swing. In this month, the number of two out runs compared to last month. 
Nicky pulls it on the ground to second, and Polanco will throw back to first. Oh. He had the easiest out maybe in his career if he just kept running to second base. He would have gotten to second base in front of Rivera. He could have underhanded the ball to Correa. On the run. Now, he's very talented at this underarm flip right here. So he, he relied on that. It has no problem. But it was short. It was short with the throw. And Rise, he's done a great job while he's been over there this season in his starts. But that little, lolly, uh, little lollipop throw there. And the Royals have capitalized so far. One in, two on. And a tough out right now in Mirrorfield. Line to right field. Back goes Kepler, and it's going to be off the wall and bounce away from him. The Royals will get two more. So they make the Twins pay for the wild pitch and the air. And it's 5 1 in the fourth inning. Witt, go ahead. That was a beautiful swing. One of his nicest of the season. Watch this. This was planned. That's a middle, middle offering. A lot of guys want to pull that. Witt kept his hands inside and barrels it. Beautiful stroke. Boy, and that's timely too. Get the more runs, the better for Singer in the bullpen. Three and one to Ryan Jeffers. Up the middle and through for the base hit. Arise will score. Garlic coming home. And it's a 5 3 game. Got him a breaking ball at the bottom of the zone. He's able to shoot that ball right back where it came from. Damage after the second out. Brady Singer gives up three runs, six hits in his five and two thirds innings. And now Urshela hits it into right center field. Here's Dozier with a diving play. So that saved two more, but the Twins are back in it. It's a two run game to the seventh inning. Juan Manaya came on for Chris Archer in the fifth inning and got the Royals in order. He worked around a couple of base runners in the sixth. This is his season debut. Junior hits a smash off of Urshela's glove, and the ball boy almost picked it up. And Bobby Wood Jr. is going to end up at second base with his third double. Wow. Up the middle and into center field. Junior scores. Here comes Salvi, and the Royals get those two runs right back. Hunter Dozier has three hits today, and it's 7 3 KC. Yep, wants a fastball, and he got it in. Hunter keeping his hands inside the ball. What do they call that? The Bull Dozier? The Big Dozier. Okay. You call him the Bull Dozier. That's right. That one hung. Left center field and caught by Witt right in front of the wall. Way too close. But anyway, the Royals, they'll take it. Nice job. 